Hello Dreamlight Valiants, it's Sassy Shortcake here today and I'm taking you through how to unlock Maui and Moana in their storyline. So you need to come in here, you need 3000 Dreamlight well, and you can I... open the door with the swell, the center one. Well, you run along now. And you get the quest beginning after the storm. We head in here, you have a cutscene which I've just clipped out and you head straight up and speak Hello. to Moana. There's a lot of running back and forth in this. I'm just going to clip out a lot of the dialogue so you don't have to reread and reread and reread. But here we need to find eight pieces of wood and three silk. So we need to dig in these glowing spots and I've got coal. <laughs> Here's the wood. The wood, it's very obvious and easy to see all over. There's no tricky hidden spots for the wood. The silk, it's still fairly easy and straightforward to get, but sometimes those glowing spots can be hard to miss. And these are all down on the beach. You don't need to worry about going up the hill into that bit of a meadow yet. You just need to keep digging down here. Oh, banana. <laughs> Let's keep finding wood. Oh, coconut tree. I don't have any coconuts yet. Oops. There we go. So we've got two silk. So we need one more silk and we need four more wood. Oh, I hate this. Sometimes it's hard to control where your cursor goes to, to click on the right hole or the right spot. <laughs> That's better. Okay, still need another, another silk. Hopefully this one. Oh, more coal. <laughs> Okay, it must be that one over there. And the silk silk balls, they actually look just the same as the fiber when you craft fiber from seaweed. That same little round yarn ball. Okay, our last wood is right here. Now we can hand these back to a Moana and see what she has to say. These are to fix her boat. Here are all the items, our wood and our silk. Thank you, that's exactly what I needed. We'll be ready to fix the boat soon. Okay, then just nothing. <laughs> she doesn't have a new quest line, which makes me realize we should go up that hill now. And I believe Maui is up at the top. Oh, we can go up here actually. It, it's a loop, so you can get up here or you can get up from the left side. Oh, we've got another banana tree up here. And there he is. Hello Maui, let's skip through some of this dialogue and basically what he's telling us is yeah he might help us but we need to find out how awesome he is first. So a little conceited, let's go back to Moana and talk to her. Oh a chest, let's get that. <laughs> so we're going to go down to Moana and don't just like skip through the dialogue because she's actually going to tell you some facts about Maui. And we need to come back and answer some questions for him. So let's come down here and talk to her. Thanks for coming to see me. Hello. What about Maui? Well, let, let's say he's great. <laughs> We're trying to butter them up here. So let's skip through that dialogue. She'll tell you a few facts. And now we need to head up to Maui. I'm just going to fast forward my running because there's a lot of back and forth running in this oh. one. Now we need to tell Maui his official title, which of course is Maui, shapeshifter, demigod of the wind and sea, hero to all. The other option was awesome guy. <laughs> so I think you can use some common sense to figure this one out. Next question, what did he bury to make a coconut tree? Coconuts, eels, or fish hook? Well, that's obvious too, he buried an eel. It says so in the song. And finally, question number three, what power do I get from my fish hook? And he is a shapeshifter. He can shapeshift from that. And that's all we need to answer. So these are kind of questions that you know anyway if you've watched the movie. But you get all these answers from uh, Moana. Now we've got our pickaxe which Maui has so thoughtfully upgraded for us. Thank you. <laughs> we just had to play to his ego a little. So now run back down this hill again and we need to head to the boat and break these seashells or debris, I think they're called. I usually just refer to them as shell rock thingies. <laughs> but they are sea debris. So break all of these behind the boat. Here's the last one. And then we head back to Moana, I believe. 
Oh no, we need to tell Maui first. That's right. Run up the hill, tell Maui, then run back down and tell Moana. <laughs> okay, I did it. Hooray. So Maui just tells us how we're not as awesome as he is. You get get to choose one of these. I'm going to say strong. Maybe one day I can be as strong as you. And he's telling me no. That's not going to be a thing. Run back down the hill and tell Moana now. <laughs> Hello Moana, we fixed your boat. We've made space for you to get out. Let's go sailing. All right, let's board the boat. Look how beautiful it is out here. It's all sparkly. Okay, let's talk to Moana. <laughs> now that we're on the ocean, I have something I want. When I was working on the canoe, I found this stuck between two planks. So she's going to give you something. You have to open it and take a look at it. It's like a memory, I think. So open up your bag and just right click or left click and say open and we open up this memory and basically it's a map of the area so we've got all the different little areas on here I think there's four different places that you can sail to now let's talk Hello. to Moana again and she says oh wow it's a map now it makes sense I guess we've unlocked that memory in her let's take a look around mm. So basically we need to go fishing, but first we need to find some light because it's too dark. Thanks for coming to see me. So I already tried like all the places. This is the fourth time I'm trying. Let's head to the coral reef. Thanks. <laughs> I went to every single place so far and none of them had light. And finally here at the coral reef is where the light was. Okay, here is your light Moana. Now, can we go fishing? <laughs> I'll help you light our way. Let's head back to the edge of the mist. Great. Let's talk later. Now, here we go. I don't see where we're meant to be fishing. What? Do we talk to her again? Let's sail across the mist. Okay, then. The torch we found will light up the night. See you soon. Okay. Oh, there it is. There's the glowing spot with the, the orange or the gold circle. Oh, it's not quite sitting right here. There we go. And we're just going to fish up a fish here for her. And you only need to fish one fish. It's this albino tuna. Here we go. Let's take that back to Moana. She'll be happy about that. And then I think that's kind of all for Thanks Moana. For so you unlock Moana. She said she'll meet you back at your village, basically. So we need to run back to our glowing space. And this doesn't actually unlock Maui straight away either. You do have to come back here and unlock Maui separately. So let's head back here. I've headed back through the castle and down onto the beach because we need to place a house for Moana. Where's the best spot for this? I'm thinking maybe this spot here. It's kind of like a bit of a corner section. So we go into the furniture, press the letter F, and you will come into your inventory, and there her plot will be. Oh, not sure which way I should orient this. I might place it down and change it once it's built. And you do have to pay for this. This costs 2,000 gold, which is the same as Wally's and Remy's houses as well. So it's not too pricey. Unlike Ursula's, <laughs> which I think is 10,000 gold. I like that they've made these first few quite affordable. So it doesn't matter uh, what what order you do them in. you can It's attainable in the early game. And here we go. Moana is coming to live in your village. This is wonderful. And she's super stoked about it too, which is great. Let's take a little selfie and then we need to go about getting Maui to our island. <laughs> All right, that's a good one. Okay, hello Moana. 
So you need to talk to her to finish off the quest. Oh, this place is so beautiful. I'm going to say beautiful. And basically she's just like, oh, it's lots of hard work. And that will complete the quest. Then you need to speak to her again just to trigger the Maui quest. So you just have a little chat to her. Have I been sailing for before? Uh, I'm going to say yes. We just did that together like two minutes ago. So now you trigger a feast worthy of a demigod to unlock Maui. So you head back through the wave door and head up the hill once again. Hey, Here Maui will so be annoyed that Moana left no. without him and he kind of says, oh, you're not you're the real deal, worthy of my company in your village. You need to prove to me that it's a cool place to hang out. So we need to make him three three star rated recipes. So this can be any three star rated recipe. Oh, I've got a customer in here. So I'm going, you can come here to recipes. You can choose, just scroll through this list and look for a three star, or you can press the quest marker and a recipe should pop up too. I've chosen grilled veggie platter. I'm going to auto fill this and it's come up with corn. You can pick any vegetable here except lettuce because that will craft you a salad. But I'm going to go back in with the corn because I have a lot of that right now. Let's craft this and we need to craft three of these. So I'm just going to speed through and make another two of these. So we have three in total and then we run back to Maui. One, two and number three. Okay, that's all we need. We're back at Maui here and we give him his his three star recipes, whatever recipe oh, you chose. Hey. Have a little dialogue and then Basically, you go and place his home down now. We'll have that in the furniture tab again. So you head back out of here. I'm going to head back onto the beach again. And where should I put this? So this one needs to go into the water, not the land. I found before I placed one, put it in the water and it was too far out. I couldn't do the little Scrooge item. We can now break these, the smaller ones, not the larger ones. And I can't get through. <laughs> so let's let's pick a spot. I think we want it close-ish to Moana's. And we can't go in too deep or else we can't build it. Because you won't be able to reach the Scrooge sign. So hopefully that's close enough. I think that should be plenty close enough. I wish I could put a bit a bit deeper. But you can't access it if you do. And how much does Maui's house cost? This one is a little bit more pricey, but it's still affordable at 5,000 gold. For a cave. 5,000 gold. <laughs> I feel like Moana's house... It doesn't make sense. The pricing just doesn't make sense. <laughs> okay, so now you have unlocked Maui and basically... That's it. With quest son, you just need to have a little chat with him, take a photo. And we have completed. So thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe to Boss Family Plays. And I will see you in my next video. Okay, we've got our picture. And here you just run up to Maui, have one last little chat, and it will complete the quest. Okay, thanks for watching. Goodbye.